During the pandemic, she has given away food. She's also given food advice to families trying to stay healthy during the pandemic. This coming weekend, she will make sure young athletes can stay on the field. So let's bring in Chef BC from That's So Good Pop-Up Buffet. Thank you so much for joining us. Good morning, Kim. Good morning. Well, you are catering <laughs> this weekend's Jed Stuttgart football camp. He's the head football coach for Lindenwood University. How many people yes, do you it. expect to feed? Well, we're going to be coming out on Friday and Saturday. And for Friday, it's going to be 400 coaches. And on Saturday, it's going to be 400 coaches. So a total of 800 coaches will be fed in a nice, efficient way, COVID-style, individually packaged meals, moving groups, take and go, and have a wonderful weekend. Everybody's going to be coming out and enjoying the weather and doing some recruiting. So it's going to be a nice, good time for people to come out and enjoy themselves and get some of that good, fresh weather that we've been waiting for. And that's one thing I noticed that you never played with during the height of the pandemic was those COVID safety precautions. Um, but the pandemic Correct. hit the food industry hard. How are you managing to get gigs like these while the economy is still recovering? Well, it's called building relationships. You know, when you first do relationships with people and do work with them, you keep the communication open. You always talk to them and see how they're doing and just see if they need some assistance one day. And Jed has been helping me along my whole business journey. He has helped assist with all my giveaways and Thanksgiving buffet giveaways, and just they're really close to heart. So they reached out to me over the weekend of last week and said, hey, Nisi, we got an event. We'd like to be a part of it. I said, yes, I would love to do it, and I'm ready to go out there and help out. So it's all about keeping those relationships open and staying, you know, right on top of things. So when you say keep those relationships open, do you mean like literally just dropping a cold email every now and then and saying, you know, hey, how are exactly. you doing? Okay. So if they say, hey, how are you doing? Or go give them an incentive. Stop by, give them a food basket or just say hello or give them a gift card. Just let them know you remember them and what they did for you in the past and how it has helped your life. And they will remember that because when people have bad days, they always remember good compliments and remember good food. So I'm just grateful to be a part of Lindenwood. They're going to have some coaches out there from Mizzou, uh, University of Florida, University of Indiana, and, of course, Lindenwood University. So it's going to be a fun, fun, fun time. So if you can make it, friends and family, come on out. Okay. All right. So, so you're inviting the public. Okay. I noticed um, that you know, that was one of your giveaways. Saw that prepackaged food that you had. Uh, what do you have lined up for future giveaways? So for future giveaways, each month I do a giveaway, whether it's food, uh, money, or assistance with helping you just get into the next day. Uh, for June, I'm going to be doing a Juneteenth giveaway. Last month I did a Memorial Day giveaway for the Veterans Home, and I also do cash back giveaways as well. So it's like if you visit my page, I'm always doing something, and I'm going to be doing podcasts monthly as well, and you'll also get the knowledge of what the giveaway will be as well when you listen to the podcast. So all those links will be attached to this segment, and also they can visit me at Tasty Selection on Facebook, and you'll always know where the giveaway will be, and it's always for free. All my giveaways are for free, so please come out when I give the, the stuff away. It's always a phenomenal turnout. Well, everyone, Chef Nisi, again, about that podcast, this time she's going to address food and women's empowerment. We will have a link to that yes. as well as this weekend's camp on fox2now.com. Chef Nisi, thank you so much for joining us. You're a busy, busy woman, so thank you. Thank you, Kim, and have a wonderful rest of the day. You too.